Mysterious stranger! Yoo-hoo! Yeah, you! There any other mysterious stranger around here? You know what? How about I tell you a joke? Sure, be my guest. What must all trauma team medics swear to uphold? The hypocritical oath! Okay, uh, what's going on? Hey there, stranger! I'm Brendan, your friendly neighborhood SCSM, and the nicest AI in all of Night City. You can select from a wide range of beverages, or just drop by for a chat, anytime. Now it's your turn. What's your name? Why am I talking to a schism? <laughs> My name is V. Pleasure to meet you, V. Do you come here often? Nope. First time here. Wouldn't you know? I could tell you weren't from around here. What with that homesickness of yours. And you know what the best cure for homesickness is? A sweet, refreshing, lightly carbonated beverage. Okay, you got me. I'm sold. Sold? Nothing's gonna be sold here. Cause you know what? I'm gonna give you a can of Night Cola for free. Thanks. Brendan, right? <laughs> That's right! Gosh! It's so cool you remembered. Even for a simple SCSM. Do you know any jokes? Who's always limbo champion at mercenary cookouts? The Solo! Cool. So, did you want something from me? Oh, yes. Well, I do apologize for taking advantage of you at this early stage in our friendship. But... Could I ask you for a favor? What happened? See that container in front of me? It's completely blocking my view of the street. Depriving an SCSM of its greatest pastime. Could you move it a bit to the side? I'll reward you with my undying gratitude. Even though, technically, I don't stock that. I'll see what I can do. Thank you, V. Boy, are you strong. Here, have a refreshing beverage. On me. Catch you later, Brendan. Catch me? Why? Will I be falling? It's just something you say as a way of goodbye. Oh, I get it. I mean, I don't, because catching has nothing to do with goodbyes, but... <laughs> oh well. Don't humans say the darndest things? Catch you later, V. <laughs> what a neat phrase. With the Giving in. Come on, what's the matter? What's going on? It's nothing. Okay, except nothing I can do if you don't tell me. <laughs> Guess that's that. Oh man, you're screwing with my head. There's that tone. Yelling comes easy. Taking me out somewhere? That fucking board is on the impossible. I am not yelling. Said yourself, we got everything here. Tombs, stores, eateries. And that's all you ever dreamed of. Okay. Good to know.
Kantau AV has crashed outside of the So hold on. Do you take a blow up doll, remodel, and that's cheap. That's what you Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, V. Thanks for showing. Talking with Michael is like a game of 3D chess. Don't let her derail you. You seem a bundle of nerves. I have a mind to kill the bastards with my bare hands. So yeah, you could say I'm a teensy bit nervous. Some deets about her could be useful when I talk to her, don't you think? No. Leave the talking to me. How do you aim to get her over to our side? By telling the truth. About Evelyn. What happened and why. Think that'll cut it? No. Have to improvise from there. So, in brief, I'm just here as your hustle, right? Never said that. I just know the woman better. I'm ready. Let's go. Hold on, I'll open it. A lock like that? No way you cracked it open on your first try. You know how to get around their systems? Appears so. I was hoping they hadn't run any updates since I left. Looks like I was right. Easy as pie, yeah. Follow me. Judy Alvarez. I'd say it's great to see you, but I've never been one to lie. Also, I never like surprise parties, but you know. Yup, bet I even know why. Thought you'd hit rock bottom when you joined the mocks. Guess you've managed to stoop even lower now. You somehow never failed to lower my expectations. First you settle for the mocks, now murderers. I shudder to think what's next. Yes, V. I mean you. Sounds like I left a mark on this place. Good. If by mark you mean buckets of blood, then yeah, congrats. Came the clouds for info, left with info. What happened in between is what happens when people refuse to work with you. Ever heard of a little something called compromise? Should try it sometime. Compromises take time, I just don't have. Just what exactly are you after? Gonna go and harass another doll? Judy has a proposal. About clouds. Wanna come back? Done. Always valued your skills, you know that. Just don't get why you had to drag this... loose end in here. Stop treating dolls like meat and I'll consider it. But first things first. Clouds needs to be taken from the Tiger Claws. Okay, look. It's clear what happened to Ev was... traumatic. Huh? I was convinced you didn't know. That girl was asking for an unhappy ending. I was just surprised it took so long. We gotta do something! Or everyone will end up like Evie! 
Woodman raped her while she was unconscious, then sold her like she was so much scrap. Yeesh, you've always been unstable. Okay, since you seem more reasonable, care to explain what this is about? Judy's idea. Think about it. It could work. Well, well, Jude. See, you found a true and loyal fan. Call me a murderer? You're right. I killed Woodman. I'd do it again in a heartbeat. And if I'd known what he did to Evelyn when she needed help, I wouldn't have gone so easy on him. Tiger Claw bosses rule this place. Know how much I mean to them? About as much as you two and your problems mean to me. Read, negligible. Doesn't it make you wonder why you even work here? Gonna pretend as if you two weren't ever here. For old time's sake, Judy. Literally moments from now, security's gonna figure out you're here. Got two options. Go out the way you came in, or get thrown out. And that's not a threat or figure of speech. Just a friendly heads up. Had enough. I'm leaving. Smart move. That went smoothly. She totally blew us off. You know what I think? She's scared stiff. She'd have lots to lose if things went sour. Everything, in fact. So she'll just let things go on as usual? You have a history? Way back, yeah. I think I just felt lonely. Like everyone in Night City. She was different then. And so was I. Can't trust people that see everything as a numbers game. Line between patting you on the back as their friend and planting a knife in you as their enemy is down to a decimal. I know. Right there with you, I. Well, used to have a big crush on her. Took me a long time to realize who she really was. But still, honest or crooked, we need her. <sighs> Just think, could have gone diving this morning. A little unwinding do you good. Do me good too, actually. I wouldn't have been unwinding, not exactly. Got an idea buzzing in my head, working it, but I can't say if it'll amount to anything. Yeah. You, a deck chair, and a Mai Tai with a cocktail umbrella? Somehow I don't see it. No. Me in a deck chair is me mulling over coulda, shoulda, wouldas. Something I avoid right now.
the ground floor to get out of this place. I really don't understand what tits have to do with selling that garbage. Can't say no to tits. Rest can go fuck itself. <laughs> Second you react with your dick instead of your head, you give them exactly what they want. Does it look like I give a shit? Doesn't matter. They already flushed one down your brain. I get back to Michael with something big. Appealing to her sense of justice wasn't big enough? Michael only works with specifics. For a minute there. Thought you were about to call it quits. V. I go for days tuning virtues in a basement. Know what the chances are of somebody blowing my head off down there? Minuscule? Same as Michael's empathy. <laughs> Unlike you, I don't put myself out there. But this ain't over. Not yet. You know, I'm also partial to specifics. Uh-huh. So that's what matters. How many you'll drop. How much ammo you'll use. How many eddies it'll get you. Art and dreams of freedom can't be everyone's food. Sometimes, you gotta deal with the dirt. So, what now? Gotta think. We need more bodies, that's for sure. I'm gonna talk to the dolls. I'll call you when I've got something. See you later, V. And thanks.